Okay, so what is once again up everybody on YouTube? This is Tubers Gaming HD and we're basically back with yet again another video. I hope you guys are having a good day out there and I hope you like are ready for another video right here. This is already the fourth video of the game that I've been posting today. So I'm really stoked about Farmer Simulator 19 and I surely hope that you guys also enjoy the game. And I surely hope that you guys also have the game. If you're going to go ahead and want to go ahead and actually play with your friends on servers and different kind of stuff, go ahead and check GG Portal. There's a link in the description down below for GG Portal and you can go ahead and check it out. You can get, I think it's 15% off the servers when you kind of use the link that I posted down below in the description, just so you know. It is only for PC gamers, obviously, so you can go ahead and check it out if you want to, that would be pretty good. Also, please go ahead and hit the thumbs up on this video and make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that because uh, we're pretty stoked about this game and we're basically going to go ahead and post a lot of videos throughout the nights and throughout the days right here. So hit the subscribe button to kind of follow the journey. So in this video, I'm going to go ahead and take a closer look at how can you basically go ahead and earn some money in the game. So yeah, some of you guys kind of just got the game and it's like... I want some money to go ahead and buy some Gen Deers and stuff like that. And I'm playing on PC. Not, no, I'm playing on PS4 and Xbox One. So how will I actually be able to go ahead and get some money? Yeah, I don't know. But I kind of figured it out. So we don't have any plays tables that we can go ahead and earn a exact kind of money on every hour, obviously. I would have been loving if we actually had the bee houses and stuff like that. But you don't have any kind of bee houses or anything like it you only have large sheep pasture yeah that's what you do have right there but you can also kind of go ahead and and get that to work i think but not right now i think in the beginning you should actually go ahead and work your day off to actually kind of get the money so let's go ahead and get to we can go to the menu right here i do have uh kind of what i do have right here owned Cyrus Auto total capacity. So I think I own a different kind of crops right here, and you can see the prices underneath. So that's what we do have right here. That's pretty good. The wool prices is $1,940. That's a good price for wool. And X is actually also pretty good. So maybe that is a good kind of place to go ahead and earn some money like in the egg station and stuff like that so yeah just so we know so uh that's pretty much it dun, dun, dun. so we kind of like it a lot right there but you can go ahead and actually sell the crops that you do have right here in the beginning because that will give you i think i can just kind of multiply everything canola is pretty expensive once again as they were in 2017 obviously that's kind of pretty okay Soybeans is pretty expensive, but I think you actually have close to one hundred thousand dollars right here if you could do ahead go ahead and do that. And uh, so we can sell the crops at least that would bring you in some money. But you can also go ahead and go to the garage. You have the Fiat one hundred one thousand three hundred DT. You can sell that if you want to. Then you have these two seven thousand two hundred ten pros. The TX thirty two will also bring you some money if you want to go ahead and get that. And just different kind of things right here will actually bring you in some money. So that is kind of it. But if you want to go ahead and actually earn some money, you can go to menu. You can go to this kind of like, uh, what can you say, contracts, stuff like that, statistic and contracts and stuff like that. Because then you can actually get some money. So that's pretty much it. I will, I'm, for example, going to go ahead and get this right here. We're going to accept the contract. Active. Fertilize field 10 with any type of fertilizer. I don't know if I have a fertilizer, but we can go ahead and see what I have in the garage. Du -du 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 -du. Obviously, no, we don't have a fertilizer, so I'm going to go ahead and cancel that once again. Because you do also need the equipment, so you can actually go ahead and get that to go with. So we're going to go ahead and cancel right there. So that failed. Lease items, we're going to go ahead and do that. So this is active right here. What you do have right here is that you do have to harvest the sunflowers in field 16 and take the product to the restaurant. And I just leased the machines. 
and those are what we do have right here so yeah we can go ahead and uh, get into this and go ahead and do some stuff baby so we do have the Russian mash right here this is also a good kind way to go ahead and get the equipment kind of used and stuff like that and not actually try out some new stuff so that is kind of okay I think but we got it on right there another thing that you can go ahead and do is that you can turn around right here get over to this you can basically get into this and actually take a loan of a half a million dollars so that is also a pretty good way to go ahead and start your way out or kind of day out because so you can just earn or you can like earn in but you can borrow the money if you want to go ahead and do that I think it's okay uh, to get the finances and everything kind of going with okay you can actually you can actually take a bigger loan than just 500 I didn't know that but you can actually do that let's this time it gave me 775,000 in a loan okay this is how it is so now I have 875,000 that's okay I think that's a good amount of money we're heading for field number 16 which is the field that I had to go ahead and actually combine so we're gonna head straight for that obviously I'm gonna turn left right here because that's the closest way to get up there so cruise control is on you can set cruise control on by clicking L1, R1 and the circle as you did in Farm Simulator 2017 then you have the cruise control going pretty okay so I'm now am at, at my way up there I'm actually on my way up there and uh, I think it's gonna be pretty good to get up there and get going with everything actually that would be pretty pretty cool indeed I think so that's the kind of the first thing that I'm gonna go ahead and do of course so that is gonna be pretty 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 dope pretty freaking dope I think so so yeah 22 kilometers per hour this can actually go like that uh, field number 16 is pretty far away indeed so it's a little bit boring to go ahead and earn this money I don't know about any glitches or anything like that yet but it would be pretty cool to actually know if there are some glitches so let me know in the comment section if you kind of know an easy way to go ahead and earn a lot of money in the game so far so f so good I don't know any glitches or anything like it but um, maybe you guys do and maybe you want to let me know uh, in the comment section down under and that would be pretty great so yeah because I kind of want to to know when there is kind of different kind of things in the in the map and so on Didn't it say, I think it actually, didn't it say uh, field number 16, was that correct? Just so I know. Field number 16, yes sir. That is also the field that we are kind of heading for. I think we're going to go like a little bit of an off-road way right here. Okay. it's gonna be okay to, to just go off-roading <laughs> I think so actually so that's good it's actually a long way up here to field number 16 pretty long way but I think it's okay so that's just how it is right there here we do have the sunflowers and actually field number 16 is not just a small map it's kind of a pretty, pretty huge map right here indeed. Or pretty huge field indeed. So yeah. Mm -hmm. This job right here you're only going to get 2200 out of that. So I think it's a pretty steep kind of like... Um, 
it's a pretty steep job I think because you just have to go ahead and uh, harvest the whole field right here and you're only getting like that small of an amount out of it uh, I mean like uh, like literally because uh, your things and stuff like that is not you don't have any big equipment or anything like it so it's pretty bad I think but um, it takes a lot of time and if you want to get in and actually work your way up to the top like in the hard way this is probably the way that you're gonna go ahead and do it I think so so yeah but anyhow right here I'm gonna go ahead and cancel this you can see there is other stuff that has actually been in here and actually ready to go ahead and do that you can actually collect a reward of uh, thirteen thousand dollars right there for kind of harvesting field number seven field number seven is pretty freaking huge so that's going to take you guys some time to go ahead and do that otherwise you can go ahead and do this once again get to the garage because in the garage you do have several kind of buildings for example this this oh I didn't want to sell the house but I just did so that's okay I think but you can sell these right here to get the maximum out of the money and I think you also sold the when you set, sold the silo you also sold, sold the crops so that's what you can go ahead and do right here from the beginning and then you have 1.336 thousand dollars then I want to go ahead and do right here is basically I want to go ahead and actually buy animal pens because then I'm gonna go ahead and take the large chicken we can take this right here if uh, we're able to go ahead and do that no I really like I really don't like these uh okay if I go and buy the kind of double this no it's actually four times bigger I really don't like this kind of ground right here because it's just bad it's so it's so kind of roughy and rocky it's pretty that sucks a little bit okay so I kind of bought that here we have the Fiat 1300 DT so let's go ahead and see what my chicken is all about chicken eggs is pretty expensive so you can actually get a good price on the chickens at least so you can see the ground is kind of pretty pretty messed up right there okay what do you have to feed the chickens with? they need corn okay so where are you gonna put the corn? <laughs> okay I didn't know that the chickens actually need that so in this game you actually need to feed the chicken so it's pretty good that I actually sold all my crops I think <laughs> oh my gosh so yeah we're gonna go ahead and see right here because then we can go ahead and get into this this is basically, I think this is barley or some kind of that. But we're actually about to find out what it is. Right there, pipe out. Gotta go ahead and put that up here because then I want to give my chicken some of that. We're gonna take this right here. Uh, 7,210 Puma it's not a Puma, it's a Magnum I think it is Case IH Pro oh Jesus So we're kind of just getting up to the chickens. I'm gonna go ahead and see if we can unload one of some of this right here. But the ground is pretty messed up, I will say.
Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and put on the help. It's basically not right here where you do unload this, obviously. So maybe it's over here at the other one. Still nothing. I don't think that you have to unload it right there. You have to buy the chickens. So how many chickens can I get? Oh, we can go ahead and try to find out. This cost you 50, so 10 of those is 500, 100 is 5,000. So yeah, I got a lot of chickens right now. Got 200, like in just a second. 200 right there, confirm. Should we go ahead and see if we can get... Just two seconds. I'm gonna go ahead and see right here. But I bought, I think I bought like white chickens, is that wreck? I bought the white ones, but we want a rooster. Let's go ahead and see how many we can get those. But they don't put any eggs out, so don't want those. Chicken, we might even want chicken. So we're going to take some more chickens actually, because chicken is good. There, so we have a lot of stuff right now. Productivity is zero. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and see if we can and will get some of the crops. So we're gonna go ahead and combine some more. Should be probably the easiest way to go ahead and do it. I just hate the new Holland TX32 right here, I really hate it. Really freaking hate it actually. Ah, damn it. Gonna take the pipe down. Gonna turn it on and gonna go ahead and combine some stuff right here. That's pretty okay right there. And let's go ahead and get out here once again.
unloading right there. Gonna get into the case of H front again. Gotta get down to the station, of course. That's a little bit up and down right there. So I kind of like misplaced everything because um, basically over here you have to uh, kind of unload the crops. So um, yeah, that's just how it is sometimes. R1 and this one. And then you get some for the animals. So if you go ahead and click time to 120, that's okay. Because then we can go to animals, that's my animals, productivity is at 100%. Chickens require a clean feeding area feed them any of the following food types for best result, provide the most effective food type. So yeah, that's how you like want it to be. So uh, that's one egg. I don't know how much you're going to get out of uh, one egg, but we're going to go ahead and see if I can find the egg that they just put out. I don't know, but maybe in here. Okay, the eggs are placed right here. Pick up object. So now the X is up here. I'm gonna turn the time down again, just two seconds. So where are we gonna go ahead and get off the X? You can basically put the X kind of where you want them to be, I think. You can kind of see where you can actually kind of deliver them. You can do that right here. Didn't I turn down the time? Obviously not. I wanted to turn down to kind of normal, normal time, like time scale, real time, actually. So that's what I did right there. Then we're gonna go ahead and and see right here. You can sell them at the central grain elevator, ranch or restaurant. We want the ranch. So where's the ranch? Ranch is over here. Do we have a car? I think I actually sold the car. Where's the train at? So the train is actually kind of getting like pretty close to the range. So we're just gonna stay on the train, I think. Can I control the train? Yeah, I can actually control the train. I'm gonna, gonna give the train like full throttle. These kind of cruise control on see it is actually taking me where I want to to be so that's a good thing indeed it really is so I'm um, gonna hit for that oh that's this bridge right here Dope. so half the way through through the range half the way that's okay it's a pretty good speed we kind of go like pretty fast indeed so that's pretty cool I think so it's up here Mm, and I think I'm gonna jump off when you get close to this. 
So just in two seconds, actually. I jumped, just jumped off the train. Oh. And then I'm gonna run. <laughs> are you just, are you just stupid to rush gaming HD? Because my EX, I just forgot those. They are basically right here. I have to get the EX with me. Otherwise, I can't sell anything. So, yeah, I'm pretty stupid. Sorry about that, sorry about that guys, really. So, we're trying to deliver these eggs right here. I think it's gonna be okay. Would be pretty more... It would be pretty easier if I have to pick up track, but I don't want to go ahead and buy it. I had one, but I sold it, so... Yeah. Basically. That's how it is right there, but I want to go ahead and see how much we can earn out of these eggs right here. If we can actually earn a lot of money, that would probably be one of the good ways to go ahead and get some money. So uh, that's kind of worth mentioning indeed. Cruise control is on because that's a little bit easier. So this episode is going to be pretty long. Hope you, hope you guys actually enjoy long episodes of course kind of like getting back with some more videos right here on Tubers Gaming HD so uh, yeah definitely have to go ahead and play some more of this Farming Simulator game because it's brand new of course so definitely gonna put a lot of hours into it right here at first and also later on of course but right here we do still have the X, the X has not gone anywhere so we still do have the X oh what was that so yeah pretty much heading straight for the ranch again I think it's gonna be pretty cool when we're gonna get up there of course so the range is straight up here yeah so we add it Pick up object. I don't think it's a good idea to go ahead and throw these around, but okay, that was plus sixty-seven dollars in harvest income. <laughs> sixty-seven dollars. That's what you got out of uh, a package of egg. So I can already kind of think about it right now. How you actually get to to earn a lot of money in this game. You have to... Yeah, basically you have to kind of make a lot of eggs. <laughs> like, freaking a lot of eggs. But um, yeah, you probably don't want to go ahead and do that in the whole gameplay. But you have to make a lot of those to actually can't like get into that so that sucks a little bit don't know about the spinnery and stuff like that because I think it's actually a good okay way to to get some money and stuff like that but um yeah but in this video I just showed you guys how to actually get some of the money or kind of get some money you can go ahead and take some contracts probably the easiest way so far until I get to know where there is a glitch if there is a glitch this year and if there is an easier way I'm gonna show you guys as fast as I know it let's go ahead and take a look at it once again right here let's just go ahead and see um yeah so that's probably gonna be it right here I, I just wanted to go ahead and take a look at the contract if you have some good ones harvesting field number five and field number five is pretty big so that's how to earn money in the game right here this video hope you guys enjoyed it and hope that you guys actually kind of learned something about it because that's the most important thing about this that I posted it so once again thanks for watching please go ahead and hit the thumbs up for this video make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that and also, 
just be here at when the next video is coming out later tonight and later this kind of night right here once again thanks for watching and thanks for coming through we're gonna see you guys later bye guys bye